Hello everybody, today I thought I would be outside and share with you the awesome Canon 2000D which is a great camera if you want to start out in photography and you want something separate from your phone. Now I love this camera, it's light, it's a nice size, a nice SLR, it's the sort of camera you want to take out on an adventure and it doesn't cost the earth. You can actually get one of these for sort of three, four hundred depending on what part of the world you live on and just bear in mind the prices of that can change on a daily basis. Now what I love this camera has interchangeable lenses which I'll show you now, it pulls off like that very easy and you can change it. This particular one comes with an 18 to 50 55mm lens and then obviously you can change this with anything you want. I actually have an older one lying about which is a 300mm which is really good for photography and putting it back on. <laughs> so if you imagine if you want something that's just light and easy to use this is a 24 megapixel camera which is fantastic for taking photos more than you'll ever need and what's really nice is you can just go out on a day like today and take that perfect shot which reminds me it has a really nice viewfinder which you can see there there it is, very handy if you want to uh, take a photo the old fashioned way or you can use the screen on the back if you can press play and what's really cool about these Canon cameras is they have very very easy to use um, menus so you can play around the shutter speed, the ISO and stuff like that taking out perfect photo and getting to that range that you really want and what I love about getting a proper camera even in 2022 is really nice because it's separate from your phone you haven't got all the you know social media bugging you as you're taking photos and sometimes it's just nice to hold a nice camera and you can get you know if you want to spend slightly less you can get the 4000D and this is actually the 1200D um, sorry the 1300D and they're all pretty much the same camera just this is a slightly older version and what's really nice about this obviously you can change the lenses depending on what sort of shot you want so if you want something a bit better you might want to go for 15 mil um, if you want to use a nice normal shot like old school photography 24 to 28 a nice frame to have this is why this uh, 18 to 55 is quite handy because it gives you that different range of shot and obviously if you want to take shots of wildlife but you don't want to spend the earth get yourself like a 300 up to maybe even 800 mil if you want to take that really nice shot so only what I love about this camera it's easy to use it takes great photos and maybe just play around down the road get yourself a second lens get like a mama lens something like that maybe get yourself something like a 15 or 45 um, something down the road or maybe a slightly more expensive lens but ultimately this is a great camera to start off now there is going to be links to this and the other cameras i've talked about so far this video in links below so go and check them out and if you're getting value so far don't forget to like and subscribe it really does mean the earth if you've got any questions please ask them in the comments below now just a quick recap before i carry on i just want to say it's a great camera because it's light it's easy to use 24 megapixels takes great um, photos and interchangeable lenses depending on how you want to use this camera Camera. Now, a few little power tips. Make sure you get yourself a spare battery because that's something I've done before. Been out in the bad went, ah, damn it! And just get yourself a decent SD card. No more than I'd be honest. I use 32 gig. And that's more enough for me. But if you want a 64 stream card or 128 or even bigger then go for whatever needs that you need and just bear in mind if you're getting a stream card it will take better photos because it processes the image even quicker so there you go with the value i'm going to share with you two end cards at the end of this video that we're going to give you even more value and if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and you know what you guys rock